I drew a dream in my head. You came like a storm. Now all I'm left with is chalk dust. Emotional abuse is defined as a pattern of behavior that impairs a child's emotional development or sense of self-worth. Examples of emotional abuse include persistent name-calling, insulting the child in front of others, ignoring, threatening, and isolating the child from others. This type of abuse at a young age has been shown to change parts of the brain, putting the child at risk for mental health problems. On another level, there is narcissistic abuse. Because of its manipulative nature, a victim is often unaware of its occurrence, slowly falling into despair. A narcissist uses language in a manipulative way to damage, alter, or control a person's behavior. Manipulation tactics include gaslighting, silent treatment, scapegoating, and passive aggressiveness. Narcissists gain satisfaction from damaging and invalidating their victims. They will seem perfect at first, make you feel special. They won't insult you, but make it a joke. They will continuously blame you for their wrongdoings. Victims of narcissistic abuse may experience intrusive, unwanted thoughts. Flashbacks to trauma. Loneliness. Insecurity. Loss of self-control. Victims will be hyper alert. Feel insane. Have difficulty identifying with reality. They will think only their abuser sees them as worthy. Lose trust in others close to them. Victims will feel lost, empty, and unsafe. Symptoms of anxiety and depression feel worthless and hopeless. Narcissists target empaths who are generous, agreeable, adaptable, and forgiving. I'm the writer, director, and producer. I'm also a victim of narcissistic and emotional abuse. My hope is to raise awareness of narcissistic and emotional abuse in the sport of gymnastics and bring forth change. Please share this page and donate if you can. All funds raised will go towards filming equipment, props, wardrobe, and submitting to film festivals around the world so our story can be heard far and wide and really make a difference. Thank you so much.